Hi everyone, good afternoon, welcome to the New York Times Hard Sudoku. Let's play the puzzle for Tuesday, April 30th, 2024. The top three rows have no repeat digits, the middle three rows do have repeats, six and seven. There are four sixes looking into box six, so there's a six. Those two sevens, along with this seven, which looks down, force a seven right there. Eight's in two spots. Yeah, my Shelty just woke up. And may try and nudge me that it's time to get out of the office relatively soon. But she's managed to get herself locked in pretty good. At the footrest and where all the wires are now that are all going to get put in different spots. Anyway. Okay, 8 has been placed, so I'm done. The bottom three rows, 1, 3, 4, 7, 2, 8, 6. I can't do anything with it. Okay. Vertical columns, the left columns, I can place an 8. Is that all I get? 7, 3, 5, 9, 6, 4? Yep. Okay, 7 can be placed in column 6. 2 can be placed in column 4. Four, eight, five, six. Once each, I'm done. Let's see. I can put a seven in column eight. The sixes, I have all of them. Did I do anything else? I don't think so. Uh, okay. So one can't go here in box five, so it must go down there. And therefore, one must be one of those three. Excuse me. <clears throat> okay, this cell is quite restricted. It can't be one, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is two or four only. Uh, four, two, four, six, eight along with 7, so I need 1, 3, 5, and 9 to fill out row 9. <clears throat> well, actually, that's a hidden 1. It literally sees all the other options. Okay, ah, whoops. Alright, this is 3 or 9. This is 5 or 9. That's not 1. Oh, okay, this can't be 5. We've already established this can't be 5. Where does 5 go in row 4? There's only two spots for it. It has to go there and therefore must be here. Okay, I have 5 through 9 inclusive. In row 6, so this can't be 2 or 4. This one's down to 1 or 3. That's any of the lower digits. That's anything but two. That's anything but three. Oh, and it can't be one. Okay, let's see. None of these can be five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this is also two or four. That means this is down to one, three. So one, three, five, six, seven. I need two, four, eight, nine for row five. That has to be two or four. So these two, you guess it, are eight, nine. That means that's a pair. This is now three, five, and I know the order thanks to this three. So five goes there. Three goes there. I've got one, three, five, six, seven, eight. I need two, four, nine for row four. And I know what configuration they go in, and therefore that they form a triple. 
Right. One, two, three, four, five, eight, nine. So this is six, seven. To complete column two. Three, five, six, seven. I need one, two, four, eight, nine. To complete column nine. One, two, because this is four, eight, nine. And as for one, two, four, eight, nine, I think any of those but nine are possible. Okay, one here, we knew that. Let's see, one, four, six, seven in box seven. I need two, three, five, eight, nine to fill out the rest. Not eight, not eight, not three. Okay, that was not helpful. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, so this can't be six. And that can't be six. So six in box one is in one of those two positions. Let's see, this can't be four either. So four has to be one of those. Well, wait a minute. Okay, I've got a four six pair there and a four six pair there. They cross. this cell and this one, and these two. So 4, 6 actually must go in that configuration right there. Because nothing else can be either 4 or 6. And so this is from 1, 2, 3, 5, 9. Well, that can't be 3, 5, or 9. This is now 1 or 2. So that gives me 1, 2, 4, 6, 8, 9 in row 3. I need 3, 5, and 7. And this sees 3 and 5. That one must be 7. That's going to be a powerful deduction, I think. Therefore, I know where 7 goes in box 2. These are now a 3, 5 pair, of which I know the order. Nine in column six places a four, which places a one. That's a three. Uh, that has to be a two. There's a nine. One, three, four, two. Two, one, four, two. Can't be four. This can't be one or eight. Can't be four. That's a two, which places nine and an eight. And column nine is complete. Box six is complete. This can't be two or nine. That, that's a five. So that's a nine. This is now two eight. Which leaves these as one nine. Column three is complete, and the left columns are none. Okay, vertical scanning is going to be the way to go here. One, three, five, six, seven, nine for column seven. I need two, four, and eight. Two can't go there, so it must go here. These are a four, eight pair that aren't resolved yet. That leaves this as a three, five, and I know the order. So these are four and seven, which amazingly I don't know the order yet. But I can place 8, 2 in column 3. Okay, these two are down to a pair. 6 and 8. The 8, row 8, tells me the order. 2, 3, 4, 7, 8. Those are 1, 5, 6, and 9. Well, okay. That's 7, that's 6. This can't be six or nine. These are one and five. Wait a minute. Okay, did I run into a problem here? 
I sincerely hope not, but I think I may have somewhere around here. 26789 are placed. I need 1, 3, 4, and 5. Well, that sees everything. There's nothing left for this digit, can it? Yeah, that cell here cannot be anything, so I need to rewind a little bit. See, these are 6 and 8, I don't know the order. These are not 2, 3, 4, 7, 8, they are 1, 5, 6, and 9. Well, this can't be 1, 5, or 9 by placement, except that's now a 6, of which neither of these are 6. So, that clearly doesn't make any sense. Okay, so let me take this back a little bit. Let's see. These are 6 and 8, and I don't know the order. These can't be 2, 3, 4, 7, 8. They are 1, 5, 6, and 9, but if, the, if those are 6, then this has to be 1, 5, and I know the order. They go like that. This now can't be 5. These are a pair. 6 and 9. I don't know the order yet. 2, 4, not 4, not 4. Let's see, 2, 2, 9, 5. Okay, this still ends up as a 2, 8 in column 3. These two are 1 and 9. I don't know the order. Two, one, eight, nine, eight, eight, two, six, eight. Let's see. These are three, four, and I know the order. Seven, six, seven. Okay, these two are four and nine. Okay, I'm not sure what mistake I made. Three, five. Let's see, these are two and four. Four, two. Okay, these are one and eight. Eight, one, nine, six, nine, nine. 6 and 4, and even with a mistake, it still only took me 13 minutes. That's not a bad time.